Hi, I've got a cup. Um, I've got another book to talk to you about today, and it's a net galley arc, and it comes out on the twelfth of October. It's called the North Light by Hideo Yokoyama, and the arc sold it to me as a as a mystery novel about a family that's gone missing, but. It's not a mystery as we we normally read a mystery, if you see what I mean. You'll, you'll see what I mean as I go on. There are no action scenes. There's no high drama. But there are so many layers that build. And they build, for me, to a satisfying ending. Our main character is AOC. He's an architect. Um, he's divorced. Um, he sees his daughter on occasions, on a regular basis. And he was the victim of the bursting economic bubble. Um, he lost his job. What saved him was a request from a family to build them a house. The remit was, build me a house that you would live in. And the house he designed actually featured in the top one, top 200 list. And from the descriptions that you get in the book of this house, it sounds amazing. He designed it so that the North Light would be the main feature of, of the house, this huge window. But then he finds, sort of fourth month, four, four months on from building the house and passing over the keys, that the family never even moved in. In fact, he doesn't know where the family are. They've disappeared. And when he goes to the house, he finds it's empty apart from one chair that has been placed in front of this window to, to get the north light. And so he makes it his mission to try and find this family. And as I said earlier, this layers. Um, and it's not just... Aos's search for the family, we meet his boss and discover the, the relationship between Aos and his boss. We meet his ex-wife, we meet his daughter, we meet his co-workers and this a pressure on there as well because there's another story in this. There's a, a competition to design a memorial for um, a late female painter and a late female artist and there's the pressure of trying to be chosen to to build this memorial and there's also a connection to an architect Bruno Tort who spent two years in Japan prior to World War II and he comes into the story as well and it's a mystery but it's a story of of human small human dramas as well and you see the connection between the lives of all of these characters, how everything gradually connects. Um, I found it a satisfying ending and everything is explained. Even what, the reason why IOC was asked to build the house in the first place. It's not a cosy crime drama in the ways of the cosy crimes that we, we all read but it's a peaceful read it's a gentle read that takes you into the life of Aoc and his friends and his family as he searches for the family that should have been living in the house that he built so it comes out on the 12th of October it's called the North Light and I enjoyed it and uh if you like gentle mysteries without drama and violence and gore and all that sort of stuff, this is one for you. So, happy reading. Take care.